so today I'm going to be doing a YouTube video on like a DIY um little like artificial plant kind of thing. I don't know what to call it yet, but it's like I'm combining combining two YouTube videos into one because I got both of the ideas off of different things. But this time I'm going to improvise. So yeah. Here's the materials I need. A mason jar, jar cup. Rice. And I just got this chicken rice. Make sure it's like not a deep color. Like kind of bright white rice or like thin. Like colors that are easy to change like into different colors, I guess. I don't know. Food coloring according to what color you want your rice. Uh, you would need these four little um, cups, like not these exact ones. I'm just using a salt and pepper shakers. Um, a little cat food bowl that we used to use that I washed out real good. And this little thing that the rice is going to go in. So this is all you'll need. And also if you want, you could use some acrylic paint. So first off, you're going to want to get your rice in your cup. Take out the flavoring because you're not going to need it. And pour the rice in there as to see how much you want it in. So I want it filled up to all the way to this little line right here. Oh yeah, my brother's here as a helper. So then you're just gonna get your four little jars or whatever you have. I would get four of these, but I don't know where the other three are. So I'm just improvising. So you're gonna wanna put this evenly into the bowls. So these rices are I all- have one? What? When you're done with that, can I have, when you're done making one, can I have one? Well, I don't know, because we're going to make one for mom. So, all of these have an even amount of rice in it, about. So, then you just want to get your food coloring. And Devin wants to do red, but we can do the same. We can do different colors. So, we have red, yellow, blue, and green. So, I'm going to put blue in one. It's very red. It's fine. Can I put it in this one? Sure. Okay. Just keep pouring. There's nothing in here. <laughs> I, think I guess I'll do yellow. Doesn't yellow have to be in there right now? Does yellow work? I guess I'll just get out. Works really good. No, Devin, pour a lot in there. A whole bunch? Yeah. Okay, wait. Yeah, we need a lot more than this. I think we need more food coloring. Where are we going to get, though? Can we get like paint and then throw it in there and then shake it? Well, I won't give me any paint. Let's just go see. So guys, the food coloring isn't work, so we're gonna use some acrylic paint. See the yellow works. Ink. But yeah. So quick update. Um this is now yellow orange kind of. This is full on red, I swear. She put a lot in these this one. This is like a grass green, it's super pretty. And this is a blue, which she was not very generous with the blue. But it dries really fast, so we're trying to get it like not to stick to the glass jars. And can, wait, can we just like put water in it and then pour all the water out? No. But um, this was not so good. But um, once we mix them all together, you're not gonna be able to see that it's, um all messy and stuff and we're gonna be using this clean jar so we're trying to keep it clean but I'm these are not put all those color, all the rest and then yeah we're gonna up. put them all into that cup mm -hmm. but we had to use acrylic paints so that's what we used. we used a lot of colors we tried to make purple out of the blue and red but it just turned out to be blue and red instead of purple so this is the color updating we'll be back with you later 
So I'm going to pour my two in there, which he was like doing these two. I was doing these two. But like, I don't want to pour them all in there at one time. Alright, Devin, you pour in your two a little bit. Careful. Okay. And then that one. So you could just keep doing that step by step and then like end up doing this and all that. But that's not what we're going to do. We're going to put it all into this bowl. No, not this bowl. Can't find the lid. So I don't know what bowl we're going to put it in. Oh. Yeah, we're just going to put them all into this bowl. Pour it all in. And then we're and then we're gonna get this knife and we're gonna mix them all around. So the noise of the water is because my brother's been washing out the cups, but we mixed it together good. And I love these colors together. I don't know if you can see it so well on camera, because like that's the only light we have right now. Because everyone else in my house is like sleeping on the side of the house. So now we're just gonna take the bowl. Oh, I need a funnel. Do we have a funnel? I'm going to show you all how to make a funnel. So all you do is get your paper and then start rolling it into a cone. So after you rolled your paper, you should end up with this. And then I just secured it with tape at the corner. doesn't matter what you end up with as long as it ends up with something that helps you put it in there. So I'm just going to cut off some. No, I'm not. I'm just going to pour it in there. Yeah, that was mean. So... This is what I ended up with so far. I still have some left, but I don't know if I'm going to use that. So my funnel did not work. Don't try this funnel. Because it doesn't work. So I'm, I ended up just having to pour it in there. Piece by piece. And making this big old mess every time. So that's fine. I'll just shove it back in here, and then I'll show you the final product. So this is all the rice put into the jar. I like it. Now we just got to find some plants that go in here. So guys, we ended up drawing little little faces. That's one right there. Wait, let me get the camera. I don't know, but there's one right there. Those are his eyeballs. I can't really see it there. There's there is eyeballs right there. But we drew four, and my brother's drawing one with his eye. This one, but without the eyeballs at the top. And he drew this one, but without the eyes. And I drew that one and that one. I drew that one my best, but it wasn't like as cute. Like I added two little lines and a little tongue. So yeah, we're just gonna try and fit as many as we can around the jar. This is for our mom's birthday present on the 14th. So we were just going to draw like one face here and stuff like that. But we didn't want to do that anymore. Because it looked too boring. So we just started drawing faces like everywhere. I'm going to draw one up here. So this is the final thing. Um, we will put some plants in it whenever we find some. For now, it's just rice until the 14th. We have to get that done. But we drew a bunch of faces on it to make it look cute. I even drew one on the bottom. Nobody's going to see it. But, I mean, it's cute. And I really wanted to add it. So, I like how it turned out. And I really hope you make one. It's just rice and acrylic paint. And mixing it all together, like putting rice in a bunch of different cups, putting acrylic paint in, mixing it all together in all the different cups and different colors, and then putting it all in one cup whenever it's all mixed up, and then drawing a bunch of faces on it. It's pretty simple, actually. And then getting fake plants and sticking in there, <coughs> or like 
painting rocks. <coughs> Did I pick what up happened? that rice? It's just some, but it can be trash. Or do you want to put it back in here? We should be trash. No, we should put it back in here. So some rice spilt. I don't know how food can spill. Like it fell out or something. You didn't even do anything. You were... Yeah, I know. It fell. My favorite color is the blue part and the green. But I like how it turned out. I think it's cute. And I think my mom will think it, think it's cute for her birthday. I'm going to wrap a ribbon around it and like tie it in the front. And then have a little card. Yeah. But, um, yeah, that's it for this video. Bye, guys. See you next time. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe down below. And I'm tired because it is 10.55. That is why I'm yawning. But, um... If you subscribe and like this video and turn on your notifications, then I will give you a shout out. Hashtag everyone loves shout outs. So, bye.